Neutral side action, and we're just about set to kick off. This coin what up, everyone? Never drop blazing age. In today's video, it's a simulation clean. Number six, Georgia versus number two, Auburn, in the SEC championship in Mercedes Benz. I know it's just Georgia Dome, but any fans who are watching this, uh, NCAA 14 is our latest college football game that we have. Johnson Blankenship has the ball set, and For any he fans looks ready to kick this one deep to open up the ball right game. Both teams. Here we I want go, to folks. Drop out of it. I went to Georgia's, but Georgia's been great. And it goes into the end zone, down videos. for a touchback. He makes his way to about the 48. Nice game for the halfback. That time they kept it on the ground with the counter play. The blocking was great up front, and the tailback was able to get into the open field and do some special things. Nice run there as they work the outside. Quick out to his receiver. He's knocked down a bounds right around the six yard line. 26 yards. That makes it first and goal. And this play is number eight on the drive. Let it go, and it's caught for the touchdown. And so he found his receiver for the score. And the closer you get to the end zone, the more difficult it becomes to throw the football because the field becomes more... Setting up blockers, the running backs got it on the screen. Tackle at the 12. Makes it out to about the 36. That's good for a game of eight yards. Double tight, First guy, double tight. Go down, go down. Put the seven to Mike. Watch with the seven. Hey. Pressure coming. Zips it to the tight end. They'll bring him down at the 33-yard line. What a pretty pass play. This is just a simple play-action pass. The defense here bid on the fake just enough, allowing the quarterback to find an open target, and the result is a big gainer. So There's a very impressive open field tackle. Runs it left for a decent game. First and goal from the three. Let's see if they can muscle this one in. Makes it first and goal. Let's get off the field, Pete. Let's get off the field. Down. Puts on a move. Touchdown. Took it in for the score. Yep, he punched that in from a short distance. He had great blocking up front on that play. Go, go. Hey, check Mike, check Mike, Mike six, Mike six. He's taken down at the 14. The Tigers are going to call their second timeout. Here's the eighth play of the series. Nice run up the middle. That makes it first and goal. And he's tackled at about the seven yard line. That brings up second and goal. Scrambling around. Keeps it, and he's got a touchdown. I think we'll see more and more attempts to create big plays. Throws into coverage, just picked off. At the 30, to the 20, to the 10. Touchdown, huge play. He airs it out. And he hauls it in. They'll bring him down at the 11-yard line. 
Davis with the tackle at the 11 yard line. That makes it first and 10. Throws quickly and it's almost intercepted. I'm not sure the quarterback saw him when he was getting ready to pass because he stuck his ball right in the passing lane. He gets it up and they tack on three. Trying to go up by three, they'll kick the extra point. And he adds the extra point. Flush down and he's gonna get sacked. And they get nice yardage on that run. First down grab by the receiver, and down he goes around the 15-yard line. That's three down and one to go. The Bulldogs with a three-point lead. Trying to set up a little screen, gets it to his tailback. Touchdown, Bulldogs! Toss across the middle. He's taken down at the 36. Home, 34 yard line. It's second down. Gets out to around the 48. At the 15, three to go in regulation. Touchdown, Auburn! So this one's final. Very well played by both teams today. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed the simulation playing number two, Auburn versus number six, Georgia. Now, my prediction on this game, they say it's hard to beat the same team twice in one year, and when I've been catching the, it is Kirby Smart, and looks like he's been good on revenge games. Uh, they're saying he's the Nick Saban 2.0, but it's Georgia's O line can hold. And open holes for Sonny Michelle, Nick Chubb, and Swift. And if the receivers can push, if from has good game, Georgia's going to win. Now, my prediction on this game, Georgia's going to win 17 to 10. Uh, carry on to we'll Johnson up play. I don't see how Auburn's going to win. And Auburn is banged up with the last two games. Georgia responded well at the hand of the first loss in the last two games against uh, South uh, Kentucky and Georgia Tech. So, uh, I'm going to, one part where Georgia got that touchdown where Jake Fromm threw to Isaac Nada, the, my Elgato crash, as soon as I hit the record when I saw it was going to be a touchdown. So, I lost that. But, I am going to do the Big Ten Championship uh, after I upload this video. I'll probably end up recording it tomorrow. Uh, I'm recording this video right now on Thursday, and I'm going to render it and go to bed and don't know what when I had the Big Ten Championship video up. I gotta work tomorrow for like six hours, so I'll try to get it done before I go to work. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and peace out. <laughs>